Uh, first of all, no. How are you doing now that you're currently in Israel? Uh, feeling great. Um, doing good. Um, the coaches have been very welcoming. Players have been very welcoming uh, with me joining the team. and uh, I'm just blessed to be in this situation. I understand you're supposed to wear 30, but you changed to <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you know, I, the, some of the fans don't want me wearing that number, so I respect it. Uh, I just changed my number to double zero, so it's, it's more so like a starting from scratch for me. Coach Tim uh, mentioned that uh, you really wanted to play for Hinebra and uh, the, the feeling is mutual. So yeah, yeah. What do you say about that statement by Coach Tim? Oh, no, definitely. I mean, you know, as much as you enjoy playing against Hinebra, you, you know, you, always, you also want to be on that side as well. So, you know, um, I pursued Hinebra as, as well as they did me. So, I think it was just a great fit, and like I said, I'm just blessed that I'm able to be in this position right now. Coming off that um, incredible season with Converge, now you're transferring to Hinebra stock team. Uh, what can the fans expect? With, can we expect the same thing uh, from the Converge like, like now with the? Uh, um, I mean, like you said, you know, this team is stacked. So I'm just here to, you know, help an already good team, already great team, really. Um, just any way I can, whether that be rebounds, stand, um, assists, you know, uh, leadership. I mean, every facet they already have covered, but, you know, I'm here for a reason and I'm just trying to win, just like everybody else. Any news about your report? Uh, I, honestly, I have no idea. <laughs> uh, you know, obviously, um, JB is, I think it's up in the air still, but, um, you know, from what I know, I, I have no idea. How about Coach Tim? Have you spoken to him personally? I know Coach Tim has been busy with the national team. Yeah, I mean, when, conversation? Yeah, when I when I signed with Tenebra, uh, I gave him a call right away. You know, and then, like I said, he was very welcoming on the phone, told me um, he was excited to have me. And I haven't met him yet, you know, face to face because of Gilas. But, you know, I'm excited as well to, uh, you know, play for a legendary coach. So. Did you consider any other team outside of Inebra when you transfer? I mean, you know, after um, ending my stint with Converge, you know, obviously I just kind of uh, weighed my options. But for me, it just seemed like the best fit uh, to, to play for Inebra. Um, and like I said, who doesn't want to play for a team that's already stacked and, you know, under someone like Coach Tim who has, you know, such a resume. So, you know, I'm just blessed for the opportunity to play with this group. Of course, um, you know, but that's that's what you kind of live for. That's what you want to play here for is that pressure, of, you know, trying to win a title. You know, there's not very many players or many organizations that could say they're always contending for a title. So, you know, that's that's what you kind of sign up for when you play here. But I enjoy that. So. Your thoughts on sharing the backcourt with Scott Thomas? Uh, it's going to be fun, for sure. Uh, you know, I've played him my entire career. We came in the same time. So, you know, I know he's a competitor. Um, and just to be on his side now is going to be is going to be some fun, some fun gameplay. How would you describe this differentiation? You're coming off your final season and now you're playing with the uh, you know, it, I can't really put it to words, but, you know, um, I just, you know, I do want to commend those guys over there at Converge for letting me play the game I did have. You know, that season I had a um, commitment to Coach Ayo and, and uh, Converge management, all my teammates. But, you know, I'm excited. Like I said, um, there's no other team that I would rather play for than Hinebra, so I'm glad I'm here now. One of the top candidates for the most improved player. Uh, man, I mean, uh, you know, when you're playing basketball, you don't really think about those awards at the time. You just want to win games. But you know, now that I'm in contention for them, you know, it's it's an opportunity, another opportunity for me to get an award. I'm definitely blessed. Um, I'm up there with a lot of a lot of big names. So you know, just to have my name up there in mention with them is, is a blessing enough.
How about contending for a championship? Converge uh, is also a good team, but here in Ever they've been winning multiple titles. So yeah. Talk about that, the chance to, to win uh, multiple championships. Yeah, I mean, uh, like I said, I'm blessed. Uh, I've, I've, you know, I've got a little taste. I've had a... Uh, the, uh, been fortunate to win a championship my rookie season so you know I definitely want to get back to that um, that feeling again and uh, I thought this was the best chance I have so, at that how about Jerick uh, of course he's in, in a different team but same yeah same uh, conglomerate so yeah yeah what can you say about that? Oh, it's gonna be fun Manila Classico has just got a little bit more fun you know what I mean so I can't wait for the 19. No, nah, he's not. The, he's honestly not the type to talk too much trash, you know. But he uh, he's a very competitive person under the surface, so that you know he lets his game do the talking. What was his reaction when you told him that? The same as mine. Like Manila Classico is gonna be fun. Yeah. Okay, Jerry. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Don't don't worry. A lot of people do that too. <laughs> Thank you, man. Thank you, Thank you guys. Yeah.